Let's do another exercise from the concept of fundamental principle of counting. The question is here, how many three digit, keep in mind, three digit numbers can be formed from the digits 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. We have five numbers here, five digits here. And from those five digits, we have to make three digit number. Assuming that the repetition of the digits is allowed, first question and repetition of the digits is not allowed. So let's do the first one when repetition is allowed. Okay, we need to make three digit number one, two, three and total numbers we have is one, two, three, four and five. So there are five digits and we need to make three digit number. Okay, so since repetition is allowed. So from one, two, three, four, five, I can choose any one. I can choose one here. I can choose two here. I can choose three here. I can choose four here. I can write here five. I can write any one out of these five digits. All right. So there are five possible ways to select. All right. And since repetition is allowed, if I'm writing here one next time, also I can write here one because repetition is allowed in the first case. So this can be also written five times and this can be also written five times. So five times five times five. It means 125 numbers are there. Right. So how many three digit numbers uh, can be formed? There can be formed uh, 125 numbers if the repetition of the digits is allowed. Let's go for the second question. So in the second case also we have to write three digit number and the repetition is allowed this time. Keep in mind. So the first the selection of the first number is very easy because we can uh, choose any one. I can say uh, I can choose one. I can choose two. I can choose three. I can choose four. I can choose five for the first position. So there are five ways to write the first one. All right. So uh, I can choose any one. Let's say for a while I write here one just for supposition. All right. So one is dead now. So we have only four number because I have written one and I have two space to be filled with rest of the four digits. So this can be written in four ways. It can be two. It can be three. It can be four. It can be five. Any one it can be. All right. And now the third one. Third one. Before writing third one, let's say we have write we have written yes one any one of them. Let's say for a while three we write here. So we have now three options. One, two, three. So with these three options, we have to fill the last one position. So there are three options to fill this position. It may be two, it may be four, it may be five. All right. So if repetition is not allowed, then five times four times three, five fours are 20, 20 times three, 60. All right. So there are 60 numbers that can be formed from these one, two, three, four, five. If repetition of the digits is not allowed. I hope you understand it. If there is any more confusion, any doubt, then please feel free to comment below this video. I'll definitely get back to you. And please till the time, please like this video and subscribe to the channel. I'll be really, really happy to you. See you guys into the next video with next concept. Bye bye.